This is the best way that I can show you. I've tried different angles, but uh, it shows you the arc that the steering takes when it goes forwards and backwards with the A8 suspension set up, the four link top and bottom. I still need to adjust the steering though to give you a bit more, but that's one lock. And that's the other lock. There's absolutely no movement from that way or that way. It stays there and it goes like that or like that. It's quite impressive, but it allows me to put 20s on the front because I've got loads of room. Right, uh, this is with the 17, but it's got a 55 profile. A 20 with a 35 profile will still be exactly the same size tyre because I've done a tyre size, tire size calculation. So I've got all this room, loads and loads and loads of room. It doesn't move when the suspension goes up, so it's always going to be the same. If I do full lock, hold on a second. So we're now at full lock. And lo and behold, still loads and loads and loads of space. It's exactly the same for the front. Uh, the steering's not, steering geometry is not accurate, track or I should say the tracking. So uh, it doesn't go, it doesn't go to full lock. Let's just sort of give you an idea. Hold on a second. Well, that's on the steering lock. But again, loads and loads of loads of room. So, uh, looks like 20s it is. 